Good evening. My name is Pastor Schatzenbach. I'm the interim pastor here at Living Waters Lutheran Church, and I welcome you to our virtual worship experience for um, the celebration of Maundy Thursday. And we begin. We join in a solemn journey of three days that has changed the world and our own lives. Followers of Jesus have been taking this journey since his first followers took it long, long ago. This is the night of love. On the night Jesus took a towel and a basin and he washed his disciples' feet. On this night, he told them to do the same for others to show their love for him and for one another. This is the night of love. On this night, the followers of Jesus have welcomed those who've returned to the way of Jesus after a time of wandering and journeying and returning. This is the night of love. And so on this night, we welcome the penitent. All here have wandered and invited all preparing. All here are still learning to join us in hearing and obeying the commandments of the Master, that we may love one another as he has loved us. Come, you sinners, come, you thirsty, come, you weary, come to the night of love. Within the community of the church, God never wearies of forgiving sin and giving the peace of reconciliation and restoration. On this night, he let us confess our sin against God and our neighbor and enter this night of love reconciled with God and with one another. Let us pray. Most merciful God, we confess that we are captive to sin and cannot free ourselves. We have sinned against you in thought, word, and deed, by what we have done and by what we have left undone. We have not loved you with our whole heart. We have not loved our neighbors as ourselves, and for the sake of your Son, Jesus Christ, have mercy on us. Forgive us, renew us, and lead us, so that we may delight in your will and walk in your ways to the glory of your holy name. Amen. God, who is rich in mercy, loved us even when we were dead to sin, and he made us alive together with Christ. By grace you have been saved. In the name of Jesus Christ, your sins are forgiven. Almighty God, strengthen you with power through the Holy Spirit that the love of Christ may live in your hearts through faith. And let us pray together the prayer of the day. Holy God, source of all love, on the night of his betrayal, Jesus gave us a new commandment to love one another as he loves us. Write this commandment in our hearts. Give us the will to serve others as he was the servant of all. Your Son, Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. 